Hello everybody, I'm going to do a quick review on two items here, one that I've had for years and one that I got not too long ago. These are both Harbor Freight drawer liners. One is an open mesh style which is what I'm replacing and this is a solid version here. Uh, these are items number, the solid one is 65565 and the mesh is 67055. Uh, I had the mesh in my drawers for a long time. I actually used a double stick or a, a spray adhesive to spray them down and that didn't work out too well. They kind of let loose and over time they just kind of bunch up like this in here and they just kind of let go as the drawers go in and out. So I'm switching over to the solid one. I personally do not like this one. When they're not on sale they're both the same money anyway but I didn't like that plus this collects all kinds of garbage down in between all the holes so got this one here now both of these are 18 inches by 72 inches long uh, by the shape of my drawers I can only get three out of one uh, this particular one's on sale right now for $7.99 so if you use the 25% off coupon you can get it for $5.99 plus tax so I had I had this one in this top drawer originally and this whole mess of business here is what I have in that top drawer, if you can believe that. I get it all in there. Uh, and it started working its way back as well. And I didn't spray it down. I just laid it in there. So that did not work. As you can see, this one's still intact. It has not moved when I open up and close the drawer. Uh, rather than using a spray adhesive, it doesn't really like to stick to this stuff. Uh, I've begun using a double-sided duct tape. That's D-U-C-T, not D-U-C-K. Duct tape. Can't stand it when people call it duct tape. Anyway, this is a double-sided duct tape that I picked up, uh, I think, at Home Depot or Lowe's. One of those two places. I don't know, it's maybe five, six bucks for the roll. So, I'm just cutting out little squares, putting them here, here, and then on the back. And that's it. But this stuff, I really do like this. I've been using it for a couple of months now in these top two drawers just to make sure that that's what I wanted to go with before I invested in, you know, three or four more rolls of it to do the rest of my boxes or drawers here. Uh, it's kind of ribbed on one side and then it's smooth on the other. I run the smooth side up. I like it better that way. Another thing I didn't like about this mesh is if you put something on it depending on what it was like a little plastic case or something it would kind of burn this imprint into the plastic I don't know what is causing that reaction uh, but this you know this pattern would actually burn into some plastics like it's got some chemical still in it I'm not real sure about that uh, but this does not seem to have that effect so that's what I'm doing if you guys are looking for drawer liners uh, I would recommend going with this one here. I really like them. And for, you know, $7.99 on sale or $5.99 with a coupon, it's not too bad. You know, you may be able to get a lot more drawers done. If you can, if your, if your drawer depth is no more than 18 inches, you can get quite a few drawers done. You know, just cutting off their widths. Uh, but my drawers are fairly deep and fairly wide, so I've got a lot of waste when I cut mine out is what I'm driving at. But all in all, I think it's a good good purchase for the model. All right, well I have the liner stuck down in the drawer with a double-sided tape. And should work now. Everything should stay put. Like I said, I got a lot of stuff in this drawer, but looks good. I'm going to go ahead and buy more and do the rest. Thanks for watching, guys. Good luck.